to game. Prior to that, it wasn't capturing it. So I don't, I don't know. Don't know. So I'm hoping it ain't too fucked up. But it, it might, it might freeze uh, the stream for like a second or two. Because I notice it's been doing it every once in a while. And I don't know why because I'm playing it on PC. So I don't, I don't know. I'm not using capture card or anything, so. Uh, what's well, that's not the problem. Um, at least I don't think so. I mean, I'm looking. Well, I see, I see a couple drop frames. Yeah, I don't, I don't know if it's gonna be PC or processor intensive. Maybe that might be what the problem is too. I don't know, but we'll find out. We'll see what happens. Now, for example, that was a mod that I added in. Game doesn't say that by default, doesn't say shit, so that was a mod I, I downloaded. Alright. Shouldn't have a game... Yeah, alright, I deleted all my save files, so we're good here. Alright. Now, like I said, this is a blind playthrough for me. Um, Back in the day, I never played the original, so... I played Resident Evil 1 in his original state, and for some, uh, well, I just elected to skip Resident Evil 2 because I didn't like the, uh, what you call it, the tank controls and the camera and stuff in that game. Uh, even though it was again in the game again in, in Part 3. Uh, but for whatever reason, I just skipped 2 entirely. <laughs> Stubbornness, I guess. So this is actually a blind playthrough of this story, so. No spoilers if possible. Um, I did play a little bit of the game just so I can get my mods and stuff situated. So I, some of it I did do, <laughs> but uh, I deleted the save file. So, um, well, this one here is first person or not first person. Um, it's it's third person over the shoulder. Um, but it's reminiscent of Resident Evil Seven. They they re they took that engine and redid. Resident Evil 2 in this engine. So this game looks really good and plays really well. So. Um, go new game. I guess would be helpful. And we're going to play as Claire. Now here's the default outfit for Claire. As you guys can see on the screen. She's got um, the motorcycle outfit. Oh, it's basically a red coat with like jeans on. I don't think it looked that good. So I, I put a mod in where she's going to be wearing a red tech suit. And you will see it in all the cutscenes. So here we go. And like I said, I'm going to play standard. Uh, I already mentioned what the dif difficulty difference is. And again, I just don't feel like dealing with the tape ribbon. So here we go. Um, if audio needs to be adjusted, like game volume and stuff like that, please let me know because I didn't okay, test anything. Serious, okay? I saw this with my own eyes. Oh, I believe you, buddy. I believe you. <laughs> just tell us a story. Tell us a story. Okay, well, it was last Friday night. I was walking home from the bar. This woman started coming towards me. She was staggering, you know, so I, I figured she was drunk. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, tell us, be honest now, how many drinks did you have? No, man, I, I barely had a buzz on her. Oh, come on. Look, just listen, all right? She got closer, and I got a good look at her. You had to see her eyes, her nose, her whole face. It looked like it was rotting. Yeah. She looked like a corpse. Like a walking corpse, man. <laughs> Sounds like my wife. I've never seen anything like it. I haven't been able to sleep since that night. All right, calm down, buddy. Calm down. Just, hey, you got to stay strong, okay? Don't give in to fear out there, right? Yeah, well, you got that right. If you freeze up around these things, you'll sink to teeth and you'll... I should have somebody. Oh, come on. It's just getting good.
almost there. You know me, I'll be fine. Sounds good. I'll be I forgot fine I'm as soon as I find the mic. I will, but I gotta go. Why does everyone think I'm gonna get in trouble? What the? Finally. Fuck, man. Every time I stream in this house, the phone's got to ring off the hook. Didn't fucking ring at all today. <laughs> Alright. Hello? Anybody here? Alright, I think you guys can see why I picked out the uh, tech suit. Hello? Boobs, I know. By the way, I am using controller, so um, even though I'm playing on a PC, um, my targeting is going to be a little goofy. So I'm going to miss a lot more than I should, <laughs> just because of the joystick control. So just heads up on that. Are you okay? It adds to the difficulty. <laughs> Instead of using the mouse and keyboard. Wait here. I'll check it out. I am, bro. You're not looking too good. Yeah, right, man. You need like a doctor or something. Yeah, just let me wander in the back of your store. You know what I mean? Because that makes a lot of sense. Like right here, I might die. <laughs> Got it, all right. Don't come any closer. All right. Like I said, I kind of know where a couple things are because I was fucking around with it. So, speed run through the first few minutes. <laughs> no. Having a fucking thing. Storage room key. Got it. Alright, let's get the fuck out of here before the guy gets up. Don't get up. Stay down. My god. Work with me. There we go. Thank you. All right, I'm infected. Game over. It's like a nightmare. You think? Oh. Fuck him. Get out of here. Run. No, don't shoot. Get down. We gotta get out of here. You all right? Yeah, I think so. Thanks. You can thank me later, when we're safe. Holy shit.
How did he get here? There's no other car. Uh, <laughs> or somebody saw this, I'm like, what? I don't know. Hopefully they'll have some answers at the police station. Wait, you're a cop? Yeah, Leon Kennedy. You are? Claire. Claire Redfield. Live around here? No. I'm looking for my brother. He's a cop too. Well, how's the audio, guys? Is, it, is the game drowning me out, by the way? Or is it okay? I may have to turn down the sound effects, maybe. Audio is okay? Alright. If I seem to get muffled, like when the game's doing its thing, let me know. And I'll turn the game down a little bit. If need be. But yeah, the graphics in this game are pretty damn top-notch. I'm assuming um, Capcom's gonna be remaking just about all the Resident Evil games using this engine, which... is definitely a thumbs up from me. So... Title drop. <clears throat> Attention, all citizens. Due to the citywide outbreak, you are advised to take shelter at the Raccoon City Police Station. Free food and medical supplies will be provided to everyone in need. Oh my God, this is so unreal. Police station's not much farther. They'll know something. Yeah, but what if we're the only ones? What if there's no survivors? No, there's survivors. It's a big city. There has to be. It's a buffet. Looks like we're walking from here. Uh, the older or the the more recent version or games, I'm not a fan of either. More like running. Once I get inside, I'll I'll explain oh, what I mean. Leon, you gotta back up. God damn it. There, get out. Get out now! I can't! Hold on! You got like a broken hip, broken ribs or something. No way you just get up from that. That impact. Claire! Claire, are you okay? Yeah! I'm alright! How about you? I can't stay here! It's not safe! Oh shit. Go on ahead! Go on without me! Shit, uh one. Can't stop. Gotta keep moving. Saving every bullet. It's like the end of the world. Oh hell no. See you. Almost there. Uh, where's that? Oh. 
forgot that fast. <laughs> Shit. You don't see me. Don't turn around. Don't turn around. Fuck you coming out of the bus. Oh, hell no. Nope. Nope. There we go. Alright, speed runs over. Uh, what was I saying then? Yeah, from... Uh, Resident Evil 4 is good. 5 and 6 suck. 7 was the newest one that they released. The one that took place inside um, the house. Which was really, really good. Uh, uh, Resident Evil 1 Remake. Which used... Didn't use this engine, but... So it was actually a nice. It was an HD remake, remaster of it. I played that. I, I thought that was pretty good. Um, but yeah, two, three, they got the tank controls, and I don't recommend playing them. But, um, Anybody here? This one and the last one they made are really good. Yeah, Resident Evil Four is a good game. I, that was the first one that went, uh... Come on, Chris. Got rid of the tank you? controls. But it had a good story and stuff. Oh, shit. They're inside, too. David! Marvin! You there? I found a way out! It's in here! The way out to my little black book. Oh, that guy shoots just about as good as I do. So that's where I gotta get to. We should help this guy. Fuck him. <laughs> Why should you help anybody? Get out of here. Alright. Alright, so this is storage. This is where you uh, store all your extra gear, regardless of what's in your inventory. So your inventory is limited, as you can see. Everything takes up a spot. Like, for example, this key, I no longer need it. That was just to get in to get out of the gas station, so just dump that, I don't need that no more. Alright, let's save it. So in case I die, I don't have to go through the uh, tutorial shit again. Um Hard mode, you need a ink tape to save. It's like a restricted feature. That's why I didn't play it. So this way I can just save, 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 save. Just much more convenient. Alright, I think I, that's right. I gotta go over here. Um, any screen tearing? Of course. A lot more daring than I am. I wouldn't go in there. Well, I see you. <laughs> Alright, so I need another fuse. So this door is capable of opening all the way. I guess. I forget why that's there. Focus, Claire. Focus. Bullets. 
Oh, that's right. Yeah, when I open up the map, um, just, just an FYI for you guys watching, um, all the rooms that are kind of like this color here, I'll say blue, gray, whatever you want to call it, that means all the items were looted in that room. There's nothing else to do there. Uh, red, this area over here, means there's items here that I still need to loot. And yellow, blinking yellow is obviously where I have to go for quest. Um, doors will show up, like, if I know, okay, like, for example, I missed the first aid spray. There's first aid spray in that room. Let's see it. Grab it. Um, so whenever you see, like, an, an object, it'll put it on the map. There's a locked door, or like a, oh, you need a fuse thing or something that shows you here. Uh, locked doors, like, familiar with Resident Evil games, they have, like, certain keys, like a snake key or something, so it'll put the symbol on the door so you know, like, oh, okay, once I get the key, I have to go back to that area. So, maps are very, very well done. Those butt cheeks. All right, which one? Oh. That way. I didn't go in the east office. Let's go to the bathroom. Bathroom's always a safe place to go. <laughs> Nothing ever happens in the bathrooms. Need to get that. Right, there's a spray can here. Good. Sit here. Alright. Oh, oh my god. No. Open up! Open this damn door! Uh, cutters for that. It's locked. All right, so red doors mean they're locked. Probably from the other side, I think. This is when all the shit's gonna hit the fan now. Just give me your book so I know how to get out of here. Saved half of them. <laughs> Better than nothing. Alright. It's half the man he used to be, that's all. Alright, so there's a statue. We gotta plug in three thingies, and that'll open up a secret pass that just goes underground. And that's really what our main goal is right now, is try to get underground. And those are the three coins, I guess they are, that I gotta get. And the symbols there underneath the pictures are statues. There's gonna be three statues that we have to go to, and those symbols unlock the specific coin, each one. So. Whoa, what the fuck? Like I said, fuck me. Come on, base reload. Fuck it. I'm out. Speed run. If I can remember how to get back. Fuck it. 
Fuck that. Reload while you're running, bitch. Where's the hallway? Here we go. Run, 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 run. Squeeze that titty. Thanks, as you told her. someone taught you well. Told her name. Yeah, I know how to take care of myself. Come on, hey, dude. Can you clean your hand off, please? Do thanks. <laughs> <laughs> At least wiped on your pants or something before you extended it. So nobody knows what caused this. Uh, you run faster with theories. slightly injured staff. I don't I honestly don't know. That this place is crawling with zombies. Yeah. Not this game. I'll tell you that. Hey, hey, keep that on. Just in case. I'm not gonna be around long. Once I find Chris, we're out of here. You really Chris's sister? Yeah. Why? Did you find something? He's on vacation. Europe, I think. Left weeks ago. Well, I don't even need so to be here. Great. <laughs> that's that's great news. Well, I've got that's more for fantastic. you. Fantastic. Looks like there might be a way out through this secret passageway. Good. <gasps> and you got hey. blood over my book. Yeah, we should probably get you to a hospital. Oh, 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 oh. Forget about me. I can take care of myself. No. Don't be ridiculous. You're going to need some help. Listen, Claire. Save yourself. So you can see your brother again. Now. You'll probably need this. No, I'm not taking that. You're going to... And be careful. If you see one of those things, no matter who they were, you can't hesitate. Take them out if you can. Or you run. Combat knife. All right. Unfortunately, the knives have a durability to it. See, with the white bar. So every time I take it out and got to stab. There we go. <laughs> I figured it out. Every time you stab somebody, it takes durability loss. Or um, if someone grabs me, you can use it to. Just like stab the dude and it stuns him or whatever but the knife stays in the guy and you gotta shoot him kill it the zombie and then you can take the knife or the dagger back that's how that works alright this is the thing we gotta open here so we gotta get three coins that's our goal uh, there's one right up here here's one of the statues in the Alright, so let's look at the notes. This is the lion, so I need the lion head, flower, and bird. And the bird. Where's it at? Easy. <laughs> Alright. So, free up my inventory. I'm just gonna stick that in the thing now. Okay. So, Elliot was right. Yeah, but we're not out of here yet. Right about what? Oh, the uh. That trap door over there. Right, let me grab the spray can. I don't need two. I guess I shouldn't need to, but... Just 
Store that. Later, let's save. Okay, um... Nothing to do over here, so I gotta go over this way. I can do this through here. He's so loud? Fuck, man. Alright. Herb. That's how you heal in this game. Herbs. Ammo. That's everything in that room. Security guard was playing Resident Evil. <laughs> Resident Evil 2. It's <laughs> playing 2. Uh, okay, hold on a second. There's planks of wood somewhere. Where are they at? I missed them? Them some, well, they might have been back the other way. I am not going back there. Alright, hold on. I'm looking for planks of wood because uh, <laughs> there's areas of the game where there's some windows that you can seal with the wood planks so they can't, so the zombies can't come through the windows. That's what I'm looking for. Alright, now for example. As you can see, this that's got a spade on it. So I go here now. It's gonna say I need a spade key, spade door. That's how that works. There's obviously something alive in that room. Take the ammo. Uh, is that everything? Okay, so that's so as you can see now. The hallway's blue, so that's everything in the hallway. So all right. Anyway, there is planks. I don't know where the hell they're at though. Fuck it. Let's go. This is locked too, and this is also a speed key. Okay. What's my status? She's fine. Didn't I just get then I get eaten? Little graphic. What? Who's there? Okay. <laughs> Any loot on you? This is a clover key. Club, whatever. All right. So missed the planks. Fuck. All right. Fuck it. Here we go. <laughs> nope. All 
Alright, so here's one thing I, I didn't do while I was testing the game out. I didn't read any of this fucking lore, so... There are a lot of stuff in this game to read. Shit! <laughs> Alright, so this is the map. We'll come back and get that. I'm out. See ya. I didn't realize she was coming in. Get the fuck out. God damn it. I know. Relax in there, man. Damn. Oh, that's a weak. Okay. Blank? No. Fuck. Mike said. I need to try that door over there. Oh well. Okay. Um. Well, you'll see, like, the zombies in this game, when you kill them. When you, when you think you killed them, they're not actually dead, and they do get back up. You, the only way you really know when they're dead is when their head, like, blows the fuck up when you shoot it. So, in most cases, they'll always get back up if that doesn't happen. So, I was shooting him because I know for a fact he gets back up. <laughs> so, I was trying to kill his ass. I'm pretty sure this guy gets up too. Yep. Oh my god. Alright, well, I don't want to waste any more on him. He's still probably going to get up. God damn it, he's already getting up. Oh no. Yeah! <laughs> Okay, life sucks. What the hell is up with you? Um, hello? What are you doing, Claire? Move. I gotta get used to the joystick again. No, 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 Alright, he's dead. Since I can take the knife out of him. Pretty sure. He might come back to life, though. Alright. This motherfucker I know comes to life, too. Can't fool me! I'm, like, really low on bullets already. Sad. They gave me that one. Ammo. Here just tells you how to make the ammo. Whatever. Stay there, dude. Don't get up. Don't do it. How's that? Oh. The fuck is that? I don't know what these things are in this game. I know you're supposed to shoot them. <laughs> Like bobbleheads. I don't know. I don't know what they do. Uh, rookie's first assignment. Leon Kennedy, uh, we're putting you on a very special case for your first assignment. Your mission is to unlock your desk. Key to your success is in the initials of our first names. Input the letters in order of our desks. There are two locks, one on each side of your desk. Make sure you get them both. Basically, your first task is to remember your fellow officers' names, but you figured 
<clears throat> but you figured that much out, right? Good luck, Leon. By the way, it might take a little work. Get Scott to give you a straight answer. Lieutenant. Whatever the fuck his name. Scroll. Scrawled in the corner between drops of blood. Glad you're not here, rookie. You already know he's not here. Okay, so anyway, here's the two locks. Uh, the hint says in order to unlock these, you got to use the initials of, of the people's desks from the names of their desks. So basically, we got to look at nameplates. We got Marvin. It's an M. Rita. That's an R. And that's George. So it's a G. So let's try to. Uh, M R Oh Easy The other one's David Elliot And That's Oh, there it is Neil so, let's say the first one was. All right, so D E D E N. There's no D. Oh, okay. So I guess it's N E D. All right. That makes sense. Okay. Speed loader. Oh, that'll help. Since she was standing there for an hour reloading against it. It's that one zombie I was fighting. Alright, so let's combine that with the gun. So what do I have? I only got fucking 11 bullets. It's all fucking Angel's fault. Operation report. September 28th. It's down to just me and three others. No weapons, no ammo, and too many skirmishes have drained us mentally and physically. We're not going to make it. Officer Phillips once suggested we escape through the sewers. Apparently there's a secret tunnel under, their, under this place left over from the museum days. I brushed her idea off. I brushed her idea off before. I thought that was a guy. Whatever. Uh, but now it's not surrounding it. Uh, not sounding at all that bad. Yes, there's no proof that there's a tunnel or that the sewers are infested with zombies, but I don't want to sit here and wait to die either. It's a long shot, but I'm going to try and find out what I can about the tunnel. Elliot Edward. What is my fault? Everything is always Cooch's fault. He's not here right now, so it's your fault. Nope. Thank you. I needed that. Three fucking bullets. That's it. Three? Okay, so there's a... That spade door. There's a door back here which goes in the main hall. So this is a quick access through here. So... Sit in this room, I think. Um... I was already in this room before when I was fucking around. I know this guy gets up. That's a spoiler. So I'm not going to waste bullets. All it's in here is a safe. Which I can't unlock now anyway, so. And how you unlock it, I have no fucking idea. I never unlocked it, so. I just know there's a safe in there. So, even though it's red, I'm pretty sure that's what it's telling me. That there's a safe that I gotta loot. So, we're going to leave and save the bullets. Now this guy is going to get up when I go in here. Or not. Uh, storage locker terminal memo. It appears the keypad to the locker's terminal is missing a few keys. I suggest that the person responsible for this mess find some spare keys and fix, and fix right now. You know who you are, bastard. <laughs> who else fuck it up this Bailey? 
Alright, so what they're telling me is... You see there's two buttons missing. Two and three. Alright, so what does this fucking mean? Alright, well there's like a puzzle thing here. So, if you type in the key numbers, like 101, it'll open up the door and you can get whatever's inside. So I don't have two and three, so I can't open this because it's 102 and 103. As you can see, there's uh, I think that's film and another knife. 106, we can't open this. 109 for more bullets. All right, good. So I can you definitely use the bullets. So 106 and 109. Everything over here is a two. See, 209, 20 whatever. So I can't open up any of these. But the one I really want's right here. It's a storage pack. Alright. But anyway, let's open up 106. And 109. It's not really a puzzle, but... Self-explanatory, really. Where's the phone? One second. Yeah, only rang once. <laughs> Get off. Come on, open it, Claire. Fuck, open the door. Yeah, it's just film. Commemorative. All right, so that's a piece of film. So we need. Something to obviously allow us to view the film in the role. Ooh, nine bullets. That was good. And we need a key card for here. I don't know if that's a shotgun. Oh, no, it's not. Those there are, um, like grenade cells. So that must be like a, a grenade launcher type gun. Yeah, it's got a huge ass barrel. A wide barrel. Yeah, okay. And obviously these are more bullets for it right here. Alright, I'm very shocked that guy didn't get up. I guess I did kill him because I shot him the extra three times. So he must be dead dead now. Even though his head didn't go... But neither of these guys got up, so they must be toast. Okay, um... Still something in the hallway. Okay, but the hallway's going up this way. Okay. It was in here. The terminal to unlock those. Okay, we need... Let me know that. Let's see. All right, so far, I got everything. Fuck off. Don't break out that window. Don't do it, 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 don't do it. No. Good. That's what those are for. <laughs> Once a window's open, man, zombies just keep pouring the fuck in through the windows, so. I figured that out. Now this, which I don't know if you guys are going to be able to hear because it's kind of faint in the, the audio, but when I turn the light on, you're going to hear the uh, the safe room music, which is a mod that I put in. And it's uh, one that's used throughout a bunch of other Resident Evil games. So every time you go into a safe room, you hear that... It's kind of traditional with the series, but for some reason they were left out in this game. I don't know why, so I modded it back in. Alright, so this is gunpowder. I can combine this with this. More bullets. More bullets. Thank you. Alright, so combine these. Nice. Needed that. Alright, what's in the book? Uh, medical herbs. Alright. This just tells you how to use the herbs. I don't I already know that, so I don't even Okay. 
film contains evidence, do not leave out. Alright, so here's the red herb. As you can see, it's it actually is red. Uh, I modded that before they showed up pink. <laughs> Which was driving me nuts. <laughs> it's like... It's making me rage. So yeah, it shows up red now. Alright. Um, Combine yours. Yeah, I know. That's what I'm going to do right now. I was waiting until I got the red one. Alright, so here's the deal. With the herbs, if you get a one red and one green, it'll make this. Okay. And if you hover over it, it tells you restores full life. Fully restores your health. Just by using the red and a green. The greens only heal you for like one third of your life. So you actually could have to combine three greens to get a full health restore. That's why I didn't do that yet. I waited till I got the red one. I just knew it was sitting in here. So, uh, but once you combine it, now, like, for example, I can't combine this with those. It's maxed out. Full health. I, like I said, when I was fucking around, I figured that out. So that's why I didn't do that yet. <laughs> I didn't want to waste your... So, uh, now if I had two greens together, I wouldn't be able to put the red with the two greens. That makes sense? So that's kind of why I hold off. But anyway. Alright, so this is the film. We just got out of that locker. Remember the photo. Alright, so this is showing us a statue, a scepter, and a book. I don't know what that means, but... It's now in our... Somewhere here. Yeah, so that's here for future reference. I don't know what that... It, obviously, it's like a... My guess is it opens something. But I don't know what that's telling me right now. Alright, so let's go... I don't need the extra herb. So let's... What I'm going to do is I'm going to stick the herb and the spray can in the box. Put that up here. Okay, so I got some healing in there, and that's that's good. All right, I still, yeah, I'm fine still. All right. Okay, so he can't come in. Fuck off. Ah, uh, come on. Fucker. Hope that one on the ground don't come alive or I'm fucked. God damn it. Come on, Claire. There he goes. Head blew up. He's dead. What? Maybe not. Game lied. Trying to go for headshots, but it's not the easiest thing with the joystick. I probably could turn up the uh, whatever the fuck it's called. Actually, let me take a look at it real quick. Just how much ridicule slows down when it's over a target. How much it slows down? What the fuck does that mean? I was looking for sensitivity. View controller sensitivity. Here we go. Um, right. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Hold on. While aiming, let's turn this down a little bit, maybe. Uh, a little better. 
I think. We'll see. Unless we start fighting something. Um, hello. Ammo, nice. Can you stop banging on that, please? Rather annoying. Alright, where am I going? Alright, I continue going up, and there's a door over here, so let's check the door out. Men's locker room? Okay. Alright, so I obviously need a valve. Turn it off to go in there, so... I'm gonna do that. <laughs> Wasn't expecting that. <laughs> Don't get up. Don't do it. Don't do it. <laughs> I. Okay, so I got another lock. I don't know what that is. Ammo I can't use. Flame rounds. All right. Empty. Portable safe. Okay. Portable safe instructions. Uh, press a button to light up in corresponding lamp. Light them all to open the safe. The buttons must be pressed in a certain order. Pressing a certain button out of order will cause all the lights to go out and you will need to start the sequence over again. Okay. Oh, okay. So that one, that one. No. That one, that one. No. Oh, okay, so I want that, that, and that. No. Alright, so that one, that one, that one, that one, okay. God damn it. Fuck off. No. Shit. Oh, alright, whatever. Got it. <laughs> First try! <laughs> Ah, spare part. Get open up with some more of the locker stuff. Wait. Okay. Game rounds. Alright. How do I open that one? Oh, that's right, it's that. Alright, so we don't have nothing. Alright. Alright, so we can't do anything else in here. So we... Oh, herb. Hello. Combine that with the other green one we have. Don't anybody get up. Stay dead. Stay dead. Fuck off, don't break in. What I say? <laughs> Fuck off. Alright, hoping the board holds up. Sure it won't. Probably hold for a little bit. Alright, so let's combine this. Dump these, we don't can't use those. Throw them back. Alright, so let's go use the key. Go through the door, Claire. There you go. Don't do it. <laughs> Stay dead, don't do it. Alright. I 
got one key. Put it in a two, I can open that. I put it in three, I can open that. Um, put it in the two, I can get that and the first one. Shit, alright, so I need both keys to get that. Fuck. Alright, so... What was the other shit over here? Knife? I don't know what the fuck that is in 102. It looks like film, right? I don't know how... So I'm only going to be able to open up one of these. I might as well get the film. Uh, the knife I don't really see being much help. Yeah, let's get the film. So what is that, 102? Use this. Put that on two. I'm assuming this is gonna. Maybe this will tell us how to open that lock upstairs. Maybe. Oh, it's fucking gunpowder. <laughs> Fuck! That was film. <laughs> that really doesn't help either. Damn it. That was a waste. Alright, but I still, at least I got one key, I need another one. Alright, so let's go drop the gunpowder off. So I can't find it with anything. Let's save. Why not? Let's go up the staircase. Fuck, dude, don't come through there, please. I don't need a heart attack. Alright, so I can't do anything else that way, so I gotta go upstairs. Okay. Nice ammo. Yes, please. One bullet. Son of a bitch. Uh, May Queen, how you doing, man? Sorry, <laughs> welcome to the channel. A little engrossed there. I didn't notice anybody else hopped in. Um, yeah, this is a this is a blind playthrough for me. I never played the original game either, so I I literally skipped that one. Way back in the day, I wasn't a big fan of tank controls, and after playing the first game, I just skipped the second one entirely. <laughs> so yeah, this is uh, I'm not familiar with the story at all in this game. Um, so I just asked for no spoilers. Um, but I have played Resident Evil 7, so I'm quite used to the, uh, engine and everything. Fuck, there's another one of these? Alright. Don't worry, I was too scared to pay attention to chat either. <laughs> Oh, I guess that was supposed to scare me, thinking there was a zombie there. I completely ignored that. Shadowing. Ah, okay. Speed key. So. I can now open that door. And that door. Alright, so I gotta get back. Well, opening this doesn't really do anything. It just opens up a quick route to get through this door through here. Other than that, it doesn't really do anything for me. Don't know what's up here. Alright. Well, I can continue this way. Sit in this room right now. Alright, I don't like 
the idea there's 20 million windows. Uh, just for, uh, you for finish your first playthrough? Yeah, I know there, there's, um, multiple playthroughs with this. There's Claire A, Claire B, Leon A, Leon B, or something like that. What was that? Nope. Nope. See? <laughs> the fuck was that? Was that a spitter? <laughs> I think it was. Long as jump around like fucking monkeys and I got that real long ass fucking tongue, is that what that was? Alright. Camera's still not really moving around too well. Hold on a second. See if I can loosen this up a little bit. I'm playing with a controller, so I'm gonna try and uh When aiming, all right. Let's. I'm gonna throw this all the way down here and just see what the fuck that does. Oh my god, it's bad. All right, so I had to go. It has to go the other way. <laughs> Alrighty then. Glad I tested it. That really would have fucked me. All right, so we want this like all the way to fuck over here. I think it originally was like here, so let's see what it is all the way, how it feels all the way up here. Alright, that's a little fucking obnoxious. So let's go three quarters of the way. Right here. Maybe. I'll see. Alright, well, he doesn't look, like, doesn't look like he came in. But it might be okay for right now. Planks. Oh, this room just looks really fucking bad. Oh, damn it. Alright, gunpowder. Pick it up. Alright, so we got a plank. This doesn't sound good, it doesn't look good. What's this little fucking thing, anything? No. The noise was like before he fell down. That's what really got me jumped. All right. Uh, don't do anything. Don't make me waste my bullets. Ammo? Yes, please. Ooh, eleven. Nice. I'm sure I'll waste those pretty quickly. Oh, is that a storage pack? Yes, it is. Alright, some guy's siblings. Damn those corporate assholes. They cut me off after all I've done for them. But it's that how it's going to be? So be it. I'm going to have a little fun of my own as... Stop the mouse, please. As the world goes to shit. I boarded all those filthy pigs up in a steel pen and set some C4. All I got to do is detonate it and it's Saranara suckers. But it's no fun if uh, it's over too soon, so maybe I'll give that one raving loon something really sque to squeal about. <clears throat> yeah, maybe I'll give him a little toy and tell him. Kill the guy next to you, and I'll spare the others. I wonder what uh, he'll do. Tell about justice and pride, but how many times did you go against me? Your own superior. Yeah, you're such a good cop. So good, you had to die. Man, is this fun. I need some music for this. Somebody's a fucking sadistic asshole. 
Alright, so this is what they're referring to. Yeah, that's a lot of dead corpses. Um, okay, this is the C4. And we can't do anything with that. Need to detonate that? Ah, okay. So here's... The second, uh... Coin that we need to get. Open that secret passage downstairs. Alright, let's get this going. Nice. Two spots, okay. That doesn't trigger anything, does it? Pretty familiar with how these horror games work. Pick up something good and next thing you know you're dead. <laughs> <clears throat> Alright, so now I gotta walk around creepy head here. Can you crouch in this fucking game? Why can't you crouch? There's no crouch? Really? This fucker's just gonna grab me for no reason? Because I can't crouch underneath him? Don't do it! Alright, fuck off. Alright, he's just there for show. Glitchy door is glitchy. What we got here? Oh, is this, okay, is it a library? Why is there a library in the police department? Oh, great. Well, somebody's having dinner. Alright. Claire. Damn it, don't talk to me! How fast can you get back here? Why? What's up? I've got something to show you. It's important. All right. I'm on my way. Now it's not like the best time to be making a lot of noise. Fuck you, Marvin. What's up there, bro? Okay, we'll, uh, we'll leave him the business. Okay, I guess you can't jump in this game either. Okay. <laughs> if you can, or if you can, I don't know how to do that either. Is that a hand jack down there? Why is there a hand jack? No, 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 walk, walk, don't run. I want to draw attention to yourself. Don't. Uh oh. Too late. What fuck is that? Oh, alright, that's, that's another zombie. Alright, so there's two Zeds. Oh, are you fucking serious? Fuck you, game. What? Fuck that, I'm out. See? Get upstairs. Run, 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 run. Fuck that. We're out. <laughs> so we can't even get to that door? Well, wow, that's fucked up. Alright, let's see. I'm out of here. See ya. <laughs> Do I need to go that way? Do I need to go downstairs? <laughs> that's just a hypothetical question. Answer for an answer. Um... So what's level two? A red. Oh, okay. I'm assuming that's the book that we saw in the photo. That I just ran past real fast. <laughs> and there's a spade door which I didn't even see. Okay, so that opens up into the hallway. Alright, so we don't need to go back down there right now. I don't think. Because I can't open the door up over here. Yeah, let's go to, let's head back to the save room. Fuck this shit. Now I just gotta worry about the... Whatever the fuck the thing was at here, which looked like a... Alright, 
Alright, so still nobody up here. Good. Get out of here. Hoping that these two guys here are still dead. Uh, it looks that way. Unless they want to jump scare me for no fucking reason. Gotta go this way. Don't get up, don't get up! Fuck off, dude! Stop banging on my wood. <laughs> Alright, at least we're safe. So let's combine the gunpowder since we have two of these. Oh, of course, you got to take it out first. Why wouldn't you? Nice. All right, got a lot of ammo. Uh, since we got room, we'll keep this. I'm still fine, right? Yeah. Alright. Alright, so let's save it. Yes. So, if we go back around here, go through here, then we now we can access this door and go into the main hall and we'll talk to that Marvin guy since he wanted to talk to us. Don't come through the window. Still dead? Yes, so. Oh, it's gotta be that guy in that room. Why is he good? Alright, whatever. What's up, Marvin? Whatever your name is. There you are. Come here. What is it? Take a look. Oh my god, he made it. You know him? Yeah. Oh, I'm like, what am I looking Leon. at? Uh, yeah. Kennedy, I think? Oh, uh, the rookie. Thought he looked familiar. You can make it to that courtyard. The second floor, east side. Okay. Thanks, Marvin. I'm on it. Marvin, I, I'm gonna spray you with one of my canes. <laughs> Will that help you at all? You're in fucking bad shape there, dude. Alright. Um. Where does he want me to go? The courtyard. Where the fuck is that at? So go up the stairs, or I gotta go through this door here he wants me to go through? Okay. Alright, so I don't... I can't do anything else, so I guess let's go up here. See you, Marvin. You're gonna be a zombie next time I come back. <laughs> gotta die eventually, I would assume. Hello. Herb. Ah, okay, it's a safe. I don't know the combination to that. That's something I have to come back to. There's two safes now. Guide pamphlet. Welcome to Raccoon City. Did you know? While we are the home of the pharmaceutical giant Umbrella Corporation. Raccoon City is a vibrant and dynamic city with a long, rich history of its own. This guide will introduce you to just a few of more unusual points of interest our city has to offer. The building is the center of town. 
Uh, Raccoon City Police Department. Right. The building is the center of town. It wasn't always a police station. In fact, it used to be part of an art museum. It doesn't explain why there's a library, though. <laughs> Uh, various features like the unusual clock tower and the goddess statue in the main hall remind us of the bygone era. Orphanage. Just a few blocks from the police station is an orphanage founded and run by Umbrella Corporation with the, with the help of generous donations from businesses and citizens alike. The building is known for its stained glass window, which attracts visitors from around the world. There's attracting zombies from around the world, too. Alright. Okay, so we got a museum into a police station. That's what I was thinking. Good question. Oh, all right. So we can use this here. Planks. Raccoon Magazine, Redstone. The ruby that captivated Edward the Black Prince. The pearl that the Queen of the Nile milked dry. The diamond that led the Queen to the guillotine. Uh, there, you cursor. Uh, there is no end to the number of tales related to the appeal of jewels. This mysterious redstone is simply the latest to sparkle among them. Like those other jewels, this one's origin is unknown. It's said that in said that it once uh, adorned a noble woman's jewelry box and was even dedicated to a wise king. This fall, uh, the stone that's long been shrouded in legend will be on display during auction. There are sure to be many eager enthusiasts there. Uh, but dear reader, one would do well to approach with care. The devilry <clears throat> lies in beauty's shadow. The jewel has turned caring nobles who love their subjects into uh, the spots more terrible than Alagoa, uh, and we have the uh, tales to prove it. Seriously, it's precisely because these jewels are bad in blood that their luster stirs something in the hearts of people everywhere. Sounds like a gem that I don't want. Oh, okay. Weapon lock key. Let me go get that gun. Oh, here's that statue. Gimme. Nothing in there. Okay. Alright, well apparently he needs his arm. I didn't grab the books, I just ran through the, <laughs> through the library like a, a jackrabbit out of hell, so I guess I gotta go back and get the book, too. Alright. Anything else in here? Yeah, right, so... I'm guessing the statue gives you something. So there's no other loot to grab. Um... It said Red Gem, right? So I guess they're talking about this guy here. Uh, that must be something I need. Something? Yes. Sir. What the fuck is that? Or something? Oh. Okay. I'm glad I wasn't running through the hallway. Yeah, well. It's not something you see every day. Fucking helicopter.